are Storm. Storm. Woo. I'm Sandy, vocalist of Storm. I'm G, drummer. I'm Darren, play bass. And I'm Brian, a guitar player. We've been invited by Global Metal Apocalypse to discuss the effects of COVID-19 in our area of our world in Hawaii. So we're going to go and discuss some questions and talk to them about to you right now. The COVID-19 has affected us um, where we can't rehearse with each other. All the rehearsal rooms are closed. We can't do shows because all the shows are shut down. All the clubs are shut down. So that's basically how it affected us as a band, but we're primarily a recording band anyway. So we, we still get to record and keep on recording and that's what we've been doing. So it hasn't affected us too badly other than the fact that we can't see each other and play with each other live in the studio. So that's about that. Well, here in Hawaii, we have been relatively fortunate to have a low number of cases, but we've still been impacted kind of a lot. So we're all under stay at home orders. A lot of people have been furloughed, uh, laid off. Uh, we are, when we're out in public, we got to wear masks. We got to do the social distancing. There is a travel ban to Hawaii right now. Uh, very limited flights coming in. We usually get 30,000 visitors a day. It's down to like a thousand. And when they do come here, they got to quarantine for 14 days. And that's, you know, that's the big ways it's, it's hit us. Uh, in terms of how we're coping, Hawaii people are famous for having what's called the aloha spirit. And that's really come out uh, in the last couple of months. They're every three times a week, there's like a food drive, food distribution for everyone in need that, you know, needs to get food because they're falling on hard times. So we're doing that. We're staying strong and we're just trying to show our aloha. That's a good question. It has affected not only the Hawaiian music scene, but the entire music scene in Hawaii. For all of the performing artists, you know, that do multiple genres from Hawaiian music to rap music to reggae music to you know cover band music to metal which is what we do uh, to the point where they have literally paralyzed us and we're not able to perform which has caused many families um, they're, they're out of luck they're, they can't work they're unemployed at the moment so that's a really um, big hit for the music industry here. Um, what is this? How are we coping with that? A lot of people have been, you know, struggling trying to get unemployment so that they could meet the bills because that's something that uh, it's going on, what, it started in the middle of uh, March and we are already entering June and we're still, not quite open yet to how we the normalcy of things that we do here in the islands um, they're taking baby steps of what can open we still need to maintain the six foot distance we do need to go out where their masks out in public all the stores we need to wear masks so restaurants have been hit uh, bars have been hit all the places that we would gig at are affected because they just that this, that's, those are social areas where we get together to appreciate music and that's one of the biggest uh, you know draws or it's affected by COVID because it's a uh, it can be very uh, contagious in that way in large amounts of people. So you know we're all musicians and as far as this topic, we're talking about metal music in Hawaii, but in general, you know, everyone's a musician. 
and you know take pride in the art that we do um and this is our challenging times right now so i think everyone across the world pretty much has to look at this as a challenge right and so what you want to do is take that challenge and try to come up with uh positive things from it uh as artists we can come up with the uh, music we can derive songs from from this particular situation and we can also look at uh, being stronger people right being stronger citizens pretty much of the world right and so the thought that i would say for the internationalist community is to be positive um do things that can help strengthen each other because you know when you have a when you have a problem like this that just covers the entire earth it's like you know that should actually bring everybody together like one gigantic family and then everybody works together to try to solve problems and um uh, just be as one you know um there's no reason i don't think to to be negative about it because it's not going to do anything it's not going to help so yeah everyone should be a positive force and help each other out just think of the world as one gigantic family and you're all trying to work with it together okay we'd like to say a lot to you guys thank you for tuning in we'd like to thank uh reese stevenson if i, I hope i pronounced your name right but thank you for inviting us uh to discuss covid19 and how it's affecting us in hawaii and our music scene and we'll all see you keep on rocking stay healthy take care of each other Stay safe, wear your masks, and we'll see you guys soon. Keep rocking.